Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play The Elder Scrolls III, Morrowind, Game of the Year Edition. In our last video, Fetter began exploring Labor Town in Balmora. He started with the Council Club, and met some members of the Kimonatong, and my, what fun they all had together. Ah, yes. He then proceeded northward, entering the buildings that he could, until he reached these stairs and went down this alley, finding a few goodies on the way, and exited here, back into the commercial district. He then went around and north again, until arriving where he is now. So let's continue. I want to talk to these people. Is there something you need? Ah, um, her first, actually. Hi. I'm listening. Go ahead. Hello, friend. I'm Jalosa Atherin. Welcome to Balmora. If you have a question, I'll be happy to answer it. Or try, anyway. And if it's just a little advice you'd like, that's fine, too. Well, what's your background? I am Jalosa Atherin, pauper. Okay. Well, let's skip to the four, then. This is new. I heard the East Empire Company was fed up with House Lalu and were looking for another source of ebony. Oh dear! Well, I'd better go tell Neleno Dorvain, because I'm House Lalu now. Well, we might hear more about that later. I don't know. We've heard that, and that, and this is new. Many Dunmer and Morrowind don't like Outlander Dunmer. Dark Elves born and raised to Imperial ways can't understand what it is to be a Dunmer born and bred. Yeah, we've we've heard stuff like that before, just not phrased exactly like that. But okay. Well, that's it. Thanks. Well, we can talk to you. I don't believe I've seen a Dark Elf with such a grand outfit in some time. Can I help you? Uh... Not really, I guess. Uh, heard any good rumors? The Halalu and Telvanni have been fighting over Odinirin for years. I don't know what that is, but uh, thanks all the same, Rarerin Raderis. Wealth beyond measure, what do you need? Okay, guys, okay. And look at this orc. I love his shirt. There are many creatures beyond the cities. Good hunting. Hello, friend. I'm Shargam Shagdog. Welcome to Balmora. If you have a question, I'll be happy to answer it. Or try, anyway. And if it's just a little advice you'd like, that's fine, too. Well, what's your background? I am Shargam Shagdog, commoner. Okay, we know about commoners. Let's skip to the four. This is new. Everyone's still talking about the murder of Rollin Halalo. Don't oh, tell me about that. Who? Okay. Because that made sense. Whatever. Uh, We've heard that. And that. But this is new as well. In Telvanni District, the few Telvanni Tower Towns are just big villages with wizard towers. Okay. Yeah, again, uh, the Telvanni do sound very interesting, but... You know. Slavery. Can't do it. Okay. Well, I think we're done. I will now go in here. Except that I won't because it's locked. Never mind. What's in this urn? Salt rice. How about this one? More salt rice. Fantastic. Excuse yes, me. Sir. What do you want? I want to go up here. Into Fast Eddie's house. Fast Eddie, I presume? They call me Fast Eddie. Who are you? Well, I'm Fetter Mach. What's your background? I was the rising star of House Telvanni until the barely living Dratha and Gothrin put a stop to my career. Oh yeah, we, we heard a little about that. What do you think of Balmora? I'm just waiting here in Balmora until things cool off a bit in House Telvanni. Gotcha. 
I love this name, Ed Fast Eddie, the man. Nice. If I were him, I'd be a little concerned. Sounds like he's on the run, and you've got this Dark Brotherhood guy just Probably waltz. Nothing. No, it, it might not have been what nothing. Yeah, exactly. I'd be a little shifty, too. The Dark Brotherhood guy just runs in here and starts uh, making a beeline for you. It's coitins for you, Eddie. Coitins. Maybe not. Okay. Well, we have now explored everything on this side of the Odai River in Balmora. Except maybe this little alley right here. You never know, maybe there's a crate. There is not. Okay, that's fine. Let's cross this bridge. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, we haven't spoken with you. Hello, Fettermach. I'm Balin Omavel, and this is Balmora. I don't believe we've met. Is there something I can do for you? Uh, probably not, but uh, what's your background? You may call me Balin Omavel. What I do is my own affair. Uh-huh. Do you do something shady? I bet you do something shady. He's an assassin. Okay. Yeah. That's a little shady. But that's alright, because... I... think... Yes, he is a member of the Morag Tong, because he says we. When referring to them. So... That means it's legal. No problem here. Alright, well, let's ask the four. That's Morag Tong. There we go. There we go. Okay. We've heard that. And we've heard that. And that. And that. Okay. Cool. I think that's it because... Oh, wait. Do you know about uh, Rollin Hollow by any chance? Hollow Manor is on the northwest side of town. Just head southwest from the temple. Go up the first steps you see, then look to your left. Though I don't know why you'd want to go there after what's happened. Ah. Well... We might want to at some point. Cool. Thanks. So here we are now on the east side of the Odai River here in Balmora. It's still Labor Town. It's just the east side of the river. What's this? Hesserindi's house. Hello. You're a new face, so what can I tell you about Balmora? I like to swap the latest rumors when there's something juicy enough to gossip about. Or maybe, if you have a little secret, maybe I have one to trade. Maybe you do. What's your background? I'm Hesserindi. I do a little of this, a little of that. Uh-huh. You do something shady. What is it? He's an agent. Okay. Cool. Well, let's ask the four. There they are. Heard that. This is new. The elite of Marwind may not have all the armor and equipment you need as an adventurer, but don't overlook precious stones or fine jewelry and clothing. To the right merchant, those items can be worth more and be more easy to carry than some heavy iron armor. True. Quite true. And I think... Yeah, we've heard that. And that. Okay. Well, let's barter. You do not have the good fortune to be a member of Fettermach, so you must seek elsewhere for your services. Huh. Same with training, I presume? Right. Ah, he must be a member of the Thieves' Guild. Yeah, he's sending us to the uh, South Wall Corner Club. So. I suppose it is my duty to help those less fortunate than myself. Oh, please. Get off it. 
Maybe we can come chat with him at a later date. We might join the Thieves' Guild, who knows? Let's check these out. Nothing. Nothing. Four scuttle. And up here, we can see a little more of what we'll be exploring. And there's even more over there. Hi! Hello! Oh! Keep it to yourself, you xenophobic jerk. Okay, we just went in there. Well, we're not getting into Trelosa Athrun's house. Though I gotta say, it's nice to know that even a lowly pauper can have a house in Valmora. What's in this crate? Three bread. Yum. And up here... This is not up to code at all. You know why? Oh, I'm just walking around enjoying myself, having a merry time. Oh! I broke my ankle! I'm going to sue! You saw that, didn't you? I fell right off the roof. Oh! No, it's something. It's something. It hurts. Ow! See? Oh! Uh, uh, uh. Owie! Uh, okay. Well, anyway, that was fun. Let's see here. What else? I'll have whatever's in this urn. Three salt rice. And there's nothing in that basket. By the way, that didn't do any damage earlier. I don't know why it made the leg cracking sound and everything, but nothing happened. Fetter's fine. So... Drain Thalassa's house. Hey, I think there's something going on here. Because that is a familiar name. Hey, Drain. Outlander, what do you want? I want to see if I'm right. Are you the one they sent to take care of the cave rats? I probably am, but tell me about your background first. I am Drain Thalas, commoner. All right. Let's skip to the four. We've heard that and that. Um... This is new. In Morrowind, we don't like to hear about vampires. We know that back west, the Mage's Guild helps them hide. The Mage's Guild is full of necromancers, and we don't like that one bit. If we see a vampire here in Morrowind, we put him on a stake and roast him. Well, truth be, we tell the Ordinators, let them take care of it. Private citizens have no business fighting vampires. They're too dangerous. Right. And we've heard this. Cool. Maybe you want to tell me more about vampires? The Dunmer hate necromancy and the undead, and hate blood vampires in particular. Blood vampires are powerful undead creatures that feed on humanoid blood. The vampire curse is contracted from disease-contaminated blood. Victims of vampire attacks sometimes become vampires. There is no known cure for vampirism but the destruction of the vampire. Ash vampires are not blood vampires. Though both are powerful immortal undead, ash vampires do not feed on blood and have no connection with blood vampires. Okay, a little more info about vampires there. Alright. I guess now is as good a time as any talk about them cave rats. These rats are such a nuisance. I'm worried they'll eat all of my pillows. You like pillows, don't you, Fettermock? Anyway, I've got one trapped in my bedroom here, and the other two are in my storage area upstairs. Rats, that is, not pillows. Here's the key for that door. There are at least three of these beasts. I hope they haven't gotten into my good pillows. Your journal has been updated. Storage key has been added to your inventory. Okay. Well then, I guess we've got our work cut out for us. We've got cave rats to take care of. Let's check the journal. 30th of last seed, day 15. 
Jerrain Thelos told me that she has one rat trapped in her bedroom and there are others in her storage area upstairs. She has given me the key to get in. I should find and kill all of the rats and return to her when I'm done. I'm sure we can <coughs> take care of that and you need to take care of that. I hear the rat. Somebody call for an exterminator. And There's someone watching me. I can tell. Well, it's not a rat. I can tell you that much. Two rat meat. Wonderful. And I just need to take a look in here if you don't mind. And that's why. We're gonna want to get into that. Well done, Fetter. 83 gold is your reward. Cool. What do we have up here? The Cantatas of Vivek. 36 Lessons of Vivek. Sermon 20. Let's read that. You have gained knowledge from this book. Your long blade skill increased to 55. You should rest and meditate on what you have learned. Okay, well, Fetter is about to be level 6 then. And we'll read this during story time. And the Anticipations. Okay, well, we've read that. Nice mess. I uh, just had to check to make sure there weren't any other rats. I guess now we want to go up here into her storage. Oh dear. I'm armed with a lockpick. <laughs> How about no? Your long blade skill increased to 56. You should rest and meditate on what you've learned. Whoops. Oh well, that's gonna happen sometimes. Two rat meat. Two more rat meat. And I think I'll have a little look around here. What's in this chest? Five gold. What's in this barrel? Ooh, bunch of ingredients. We'll just grab all those. And in this sack, we've got small quama eggs. Some scuttle here. More scuttle. And some large quama eggs. Great. How about over here? This is a basket of pillows. There are 25 pillows in there. Another basket of pillows with 25 pillows. And a final basket of pillows with 25 pillows. Okay, cool. I get it. It's in the crate. Hmm, four gold. How about this one? Marshmallow, rat meat, and salt rice. And two gold. Okay. Great. We should now report to Jerain. Yes, Outlander? Have I got some good news for you. Fettermach, you look like you have something on your mind. I do. It involves cave rats. That increased her disposition by 20 points. Nice. I'll take your word that the cave rats are dead. Here, take these 100 septums. It's what I agreed to pay the Fighters Guild. Your journal has been updated. 100 gold has been added to your inventory. Cave rats? The rats haven't been back yet, Fettermach. Okay, well, then we are done here. Let's check the journal. 30th of Last Seed, Day 15. Jorain Thelos thanked me for getting rid of the rats and paid me 100 gold. Indeed she did. I shall take my leave. I guess we should probably head back to the Fighters Guild now. Is there something I can do for you? Because Fetter really needs a nap before he uh, gains any additional skill points. Because we want those to be. I'm listening. Go ahead. We want those to be going toward 
the multipliers for his next level. I suppose I have a moment. What is it? I just need to go have a nap. I'm tired. Hey, corpsey. Let's nap right now. But first... Gotta keep in mind the old stats here. So health, magicka, and fatigue, we've got max 76, 54, and 229. And now we rest. You have ascended to level six. You sense yourself more aware, more open to new ideas. You've learned a lot about Morrowind. It's hard to believe how ignorant you were, but now you have so much more to learn. Look at all those times two multipliers. Ah, well, we do have to go with endurance again. But we won't have to do it for that much longer. Right, right. And I think that considering the combat that is coming soon, we should go with strength and intelligence for the raw power those will confer. Okay. Let's take a look at what's changed. Wow. Fetter's health increased from 76 to 84. He's got eight points there. His magicka increased from 54 to 56. Again, that, he does have the Mentor's Ring on. So it's really 44 to 46, but still. And Fatigue increased from 229 to 223, which is four points. Not bad. Every little bit, right? It is nice to see that carrying capacity get even better each time, so we can lug around more junk. Yay. Speaking of that, uh, we should try to put away some of these new alchemical ingredients. I'm just going to hit enter, because that's the same as hitting OK. Makes things go a little faster. a lot of rat meat. Oh dear. And that's out of space now too. Awesome. Well, back to this one. All right, that'll do. Let's report our success to Adis FireEye. They need need today greet you warmly. What's this all about? You here for orders or advancement, associate? Or was there something else you wanted? Well, um... I wanted to report my success with the cave rat situation. So, you killed the rats, Fetterbach? Not bad. For you. You ready for more orders? Your journal has been updated. Actually, I was thinking about advancement. The Fighter's Guild recognizes you, Fettermach. You are now Fettermach the Apprentice. Hey, excellent. That is Fetter's first rank advancement in one of the factions that he's joined. Cool. Well, let's get some more orders then. A local egg mine has problems with egg poachers, and you're going to solve those problems. Am I? Yes, egg poachers. May sound silly, but those Kwama eggs are among the few things worth exporting from this nasty little province. Drom Barrow, the owner of Shulk Egg Mine, wants to make an example of these thieves to keep other miners from getting funny ideas. The egg poachers, Civillo Othan and Danila Vallas, are former egg miners and longtime local troublemakers. You can handle that, can't you? Report back when the poachers are dead. Your journal has been updated. Egg poachers! Have you taken care of those egg poachers yet? No, I haven't left your presence yet, so no. Want to tell me about Shulk Egg Mine? The mine is a short distance southwest of Balmora, in the bluffs west of the Odai River. The old suspension bridge across the Odai is just southeast of the mine entrance. Follow the river south of Balmora until you see the bridge overhead. You're not afraid of a little swim, are you? Your journal has been updated. I'm not afraid of a little swim. 
No, ma'am. Hey, tell me about the shark egg mine. I already told you how to get there, and I don't like repeating myself. I don't blame you. Okay, cool. Well, let's see. I know what I want to do now. Oh, well, and it doesn't involve going out here. That was silly. Aren't you a sight? What can I do for you? I suppose I have a moment. What is it? I want to sell all of the various restore this and restore that potions that Fetter has been finding in crates. Because we're not going to use them. Well, what did you say, Stargill? Okay. And luckily, we are already pretty friendly. So. Right. What I want to do is sell, like, um... Quality Restore Intelligence. I'm never going to use it. Quality Restore Speed. Quality Restore Strength. Restore Fatigue. It's... It's awful, and I don't want to carry it around, so... That's one of the potions that Fetter made. So proud of himself. Restore health. That... There's no way that's any good, so that can go too. Same thing. And I... I guess that's it. I guess that's it. Oh, wait. Exclusive Restore Agility. That can go as well. Wow, I'm carrying around a lot of Cyrodiilic brandy. Hmm. Might need to put that away as well. Oh, and the uh, Shock Eater robe. Well, we can do that later. Anyway, 308, huh? I think you could give me 325. Your mercantile skill increased to 28. Great. Greetings to you, Dunmer. That puts Fetter at... 2 out of 10 skill points toward reaching level 7 already. Moving right along. So let's get back to the, well, other side of town, basically. Yeah, we are on the complete opposite end. But it's a nice night for a jog. Hey there. Dunmer? Ork. Yes, I'll let you. I'll let you. All the way down here. That was fun. Did I look in these crates? Probably. Rat meat, nothing. Five gold. So I didn't look in them. And that's... Yeah, that's Duranthalos' house. Okay. Well, that means that we want to explore here next. After looking in the crates, of course. Nothing... Exclusive Restore Personality. Okay, we've got more silly Restore potions to sell. And some gold to take. And more rat meat. And nothing. That's fine. Dura grab Bowl's house. Hmm. Well, I don't see anybody. Nothing I want there. Ooh, a locked chest. I'm gonna quick save. Don't mind if I do. Got it. And inside is some common stuff and 75 gold. Worth it. Nothing else here, though. All right. That just goes outside. So does that. Oh, hello. Well, I guess I won't be taking anything, uh... From up here, will I? Dunma? Uh, yeah, hi. 
Welcome to Balmora, council seat of House Lalu. How can I serve you? Well, what's your background? I am Dura Grabo, barbarian. Oh, we know about barbarians. What do you think of cave rats? The cave rat is a subterranean variety of the hardy, abundant hunter scavenger. Rat meat is tough and greasy, with an unpleasant odor and taste. Nonetheless, it is cheap, abundant, and nutritious, and palatable when cooked in a stew and masked by strong, strong spices. That's, uh... That's interesting. Okay. Well, let's, uh... Ask about the four. We've heard that, and that, and that, but this is new. Though some Dunmer are Imperial cult initiates, most of them are also members of the Tribunal Temple. Religious fervor is exceptional in the Empire, compared with Morrowind's more passionate temple worshippers, and Dunmer who adopt the Imperial cult often share the moderation and religious tolerance of Imperial culture. Okay. Well, I think that's everything we need to talk about with her. So, goodbye. And I guess we'll head back down. Oh! That's not up to code either. That's dangerous. Boy, she lives in a tower, doesn't she? Huh. Well. I, I feel like, did I miss a journal entry? I did after we spoke with Aedis Fireeye in the Fighters Guild. 30th of Last Seed, Day 15. I reported to Aedis Fireeye that I had killed the rats plaguing Doraine Thelos. 30th of Last Seed, Day 15. Savillo Othan and Danilo Vallas, former egg miners and local troublemakers, are poaching eggs from Shulk Egg Mine. Report back to Aedis when they're dead. 30th of Last Seed, Day 15. Aedis Fireeye tells me that the egg mine is located a short distance southwest of Balmora, in the bluffs west of the Odai River. The old suspension bridge across the Odai is just southeast of the mine entrance. I'm to follow the river south of Balmora until I see the bridge overhead. Alright. I think I'll check these crates now. And grab ten gold. And four gold. And a quality restore agility potion. And four gold. <laughs> the one coin bandit strikes again. And five gold. And that's it. Hey, Southwall Corner Club. We're actually supposed to go here for plot reasons. <laughs> and we'll do that in the next video. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you then.